Making most stuff would be much more like making a movie really than making a game. The number of people involved in a production like this is tremendous. Typical games production with a you know, development team, everything's done in-house. Now we're calling a lot more people externally, getting experts in. We've already had cinematographers, script writers, directors, and you know, we've still got plenty of way to go yet with all the other people who are probably drawing to the whole process. The credits list for the game is probably going to be tremendous compared to typical games with a number of uh, people who've been actively involved in the whole project. We not only want to create something that looks great, obviously with next-gen hardware, that's, that's fairly easy to make something look fantastic. We want something that plays great and feels great as well. The whole experience of MotorStorms is going to be totally next-gen. Not, we're not just talking about more polygons here, it's investing in technology and investing time and effort in lots of the other details, you know, more physics, improved handling, the whole player experience. Cinematography plays an enormous part of it. Instead of typically our own art team developing all the art assets, we've got car designers involved and professional car designers, you know, do this every day in, day out, generating fantastic concepts for the car industry. We've been generating cars for our game. We've also been involved with uh, script writers who typically write for movies, uh, cinematographers and directors of photography who know an awful lot about how to tone the image and things like that. That's all been rolled into this game as well. They sort of move over Jerry Bruckheimer, you know, we're, we're in the movie industry now. Thank <laughs> you.